believe in yourself and work hard. Know what you're worth, know what you're capable of, and it can happen. Resilience is very important. I had like tragedy after shit out of luck after just missed opportunity after missed opportunity for streaming my entire like career and I, I just never stopped because I knew that if I just kept trying, I knew that at some point I would go from point A to point B. I knew my skill, like I knew I knew what I was capable of, I knew how talented I was at, at gaming and I just knew that if I just kept, like, you know, like I, I, I always had long talks with my wife and, and like we always came to the conclusion that like I just need to keep streaming, like, I just need to keep going and at some point like something like like you'll take off like, at some point and uh, I mean here we are I don't think that this is the end I think that we're not even, we haven't I haven't even begun I'm gonna fucking keep grinding dude fucking streaming every day like the sky's the limit you can't connect the dots looking forward you can only connect them looking backwards so you have to trust that the dots will somehow connect in your future you have to trust in something, your gut, destiny, life, karma, whatever, because believing that the dots will connect down the road will give you the confidence to follow your heart even when it leads you off the well-worn path, and that will make all the difference. Sometimes life's going to hit you in the head with a brick. Don't lose faith. I'm convinced that the only thing that kept me going was that I loved what I did. You've got to find what you love. And that is as true for work as it is for your lovers. Your work is going to fill a large part of your life. And the only way to be truly satisfied is to do what you believe is great work. And the only way to do great work is to love what you do. If you haven't found it yet, keep looking and don't settle. Your time is limited, so don't waste it living someone else's life. Don't be trapped by dogma which is living with the results of other people's thinking. Don't let the noise of others' opinions drown out your own inner voice. And most important, have the courage to follow your heart and intuition. They somehow already know what you truly want to become. Everybody's asleep, man. We're just getting home after a long night. It's uh, close to three in the morning right now. You know, the thing is, man, it's always gonna be a party. There's always going to be a time to celebrate and a time to join friends and or a day to, I mean, the bars are always open, always open. No matter how old you are, they're always open, you know? What's not always open is the opportunity to, to check the box in life, you know, to achieve your dreams. That's not always open. You know, when, when, you, when you say you're going to do something and then you follow through and you do it, not, not, not at the end when you, you know, you cross the marathon, you finish it, or, or your hands raised. I'm talking about right now. The small steps in between the big successes that everyone sees. No one sees this. There's a confidence to it, man. There's this, there's a bad motherfucker that's right here, you know, that it's getting ahead of the competition. There's an overwhelming sense of fulfillment and pride and satisfaction with that. You don't get that sense of, of confidence by going through society's rhyme the reasons. You know, you do your own thing, you know, especially when everyone else isn't doing it and they call you crazy, whatever else, oh, you're in here, and what the fuck is that guy doing up so late? Well, what's up so late mean? I don't know. It's the moments in life, the decisions you make on a moment-to-moment on a, on a -moment basis that add up to be the guy or not the guy. <laughs>